I guess that means you have to get your New Year's Eve dinner plan since you're going to pick something up and obviously eat it at home. You have to do so a little bit earlier. Maybe even cupcakes. That's a good idea as well. That's what I'm getting. All right. We're going to see a cold front move through the area. That's also going to bring some rain. So as you do travel to pick up some of the uh, food for your party inside your own house, you might have to do so dodging some raindrops. Right now, though, mostly cloudy skies into Baltimore. I'm noticing no rainfall just quite yet in the area. This is going to change in just a matter of a few hours. Radar sweeping clean for us in the meantime. Temperature-wise, as you head out the door ahead of that front, we are warm for you. 45 degrees out over toward Bel Air, 50 degrees in the Inner Harbor as we await the arrival of the cold front. It is just knocking on our door and along with it, a plethora of rainfall as well. So calling for scattered showers earlier this afternoon and we'll notice our temperatures starting to fall as that front moves through. I think overall we'll see our temperatures maybe about five degrees cooler than where we were yesterday. And then as we head through uh, our Friday, another five degrees cooler. This time, though, we also have an increase in cloud coverage out there. A storm system hanging off out to our west is going to also increase the rain chance. So when the rain starts today, we pretty much keep the chance of precipitation all the way through the weekend. Right now, it does look like Friday, though, will be the day that has the most intense precipitation. Let's focus it on today, though. Here's your hour by hour forecast starting you off right around 11 o'clock in the morning. You can see just to the north of Baltimore County, that's where they're going to start seeing the rainfall. In fact, heavy spans will be found right along the PA Maryland border. By 12 30 now it begins to sink a little bit further to the south heading out over toward Moncton pushing even out over toward Cockeysville and then once you get to about 145 it's in Lutherville area pushing into Towson as well and then rolling through the city closer to about the 345 time frame heading out over toward Annapolis closer to about the 430 time. Showers are going to decrease in intensity but still light rainfall possible at 630 like I said as you maybe pick up some of the uh, food you're going to be eating at your home for your own New Year's Eve party and by 945 it is out of here. We'll end up seeing partly cloudy skies over the evening until we get that second storm system that should arrive tomorrow afternoon. So for today, 9 a.m., 44 degrees. Notice how the temperatures continue to fall. The best chance of rain between around 1 to 3 o'clock for you. And then tonight, you're looking at 35 degrees. Only a 10% chance of rain as you ring in the new year. Seven-day forecast for you. Tomorrow, we fall another 5 degrees to 40 degrees. It will be fairly wet and foggy as well. Saturday, we warm up, though, to 60. Lauren, how are those roads? Mm -hmm.